right, good morning for this Wednesday, April 16th, and we are looking at the stock that we took a trade in three days ago, and take a look at this. Wish every single trade worked out this beautifully so quick. If you recall, this is the stock AGN, right? Remember AGN, we bought right here, right? Remember there was some indecision down in here in the gray action zone, a beautiful support zone. Went long, if you recall, at 121.63. First profit target was hit on yesterday's video as I was putting that together yesterday morning at 126.50. 126.50 was that first profit target. Now we're trailing up the market. So it took 60% of that position off. At 126.50, made 5.12 on that trade. Not bad. Not bad at all. Market moved higher. Closed at about 127.70. Gapped even higher today, as you can see. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move that trailing stop up to 20 cents below yesterday's high. Yesterday's high was 127.96. So 127. 776 is the trailing stop. 127.76. All right. 127.76. Locking in $6.13 on the remaining portion of my position. Okay. Now, we are looking for the market to try to retest this high right in here. That's at 132.04. Today's high is 130.40. So, again, not a bad trade. Remember yesterday in the E-mini S&Ps, I was calling that the market was going higher. Again, we traded a beautiful pattern there. I mean, you could you could uh, you could trade the SSO, which mirrors the S&Ps. You don't want to trade the futures, but they coiled up beautifully. You had a tight little inside bar right in that gray action zone. Popped right up through it, and we're up about what 20 points or more through it. That high, we were looking for the penetration up to 1828 to 1828 and a quarter to 1828 and three quarters. Look at how far we've gone. 51, folks, 51. A 23 point rally, which is roughly about a 230 point down move to the upside since breaking through Monday's high. Monday's high. So that was a nice trade. Let's, let's revisit oil again, right? Crude oil. What have I been saying for about a month and a half now? Right? Go back on some prior videos. Right? I was looking for the market to move higher. Right? Beautiful area. Beautiful pattern setups in here as well. And I told you that the trade, to take that trade back to retest these highs, and we eventually did it. Boom. Back up. So, crude oil is strong. We've taken out these highs. Now the question is, how high can we go? And if you really crunch your chart, you can take a look at... So, we have penetrated up through this high right in here. Right? We've penetrated up through 104.40. Haven't closed up through it yet. So, today may close up through it. It's a big level here, 104.40, okay? Big level, 104.40. We had a high up in here, about 104.40 as well. Look at that. These highs are right up in here, 104.51. So we got a nice little ledge. We break up through it on a closing basis. We could, well, we could run much higher. But no doubt, if the market pulls back, we would be looking for another pullback to get long oil, or you could take advantage of the USO, okay? The, the ETF. So, hope that helps. Have a profitable day. And I want to thank everybody that signed up for the uh, Swing Trading Stocks and ETFs for weekly income. It was a great class on Saturday. But not only that, we had a two-hour class last night again, answered questions and gave out a lot of trades that are working out pretty well this morning so far. And if you still want in, the recording is, a made, of, is made available. So, just go to tradingconceptsinc.com forward slash swing dash trading dash stocks and take a look at that video okay have a great and a, have a profitable day bye for now be back with you tomorrow